it started when a group of early childhood educators, myself included, went to um, an early childhood conference in Athens. And at the conference, we went to a workshop that was run by some early childhood educators from St. John's School in Belgium. And there were lots of takeaways from them at that time, but one that really inspired us was the fact that they had chickens on campus. So we became friendly with the teachers there and said that that would be something we'd really love to do in our school. And the next thing, one of them called us and said, actually, we're going to drive down to Prague next weekend and we're bringing three chickens with us. So that was quite a shock for us, but we were super excited about it because we could have planned and thought about it for a long time and it might never have happened. But they drove down with three chickens and we introduced them to the early childhood classes at that time. We did that, but we didn't have a place to have them. So the maintenance department very kindly came and dug it up and put some uh, fencing around it. And we had to find a chicken coop. And it was a lot of excitement about that. Children were watching all the time. Every recess they'd be there. We had special times when people would be coming and digging. And they were observing the process of building this chicken coop for our elementary school. And then life started with chickens at school. And initially it was really an early childhood project and each class would have a time where they would look after the chickens, where they would help to clean the chickens, they collect the eggs. And actually a lot of the eggs we used then for baking. At some points when we had them laying a lot, we even sold the eggs. So we'd use that money to, to go back into the chickens to buy food for them or sometimes for some charities that we supported. We decided last year to get uh, five more chickens and these chickens came from an organization that Miss Josefina found and we actually rescued these chickens from a farm. Um, the chickens are an essential part of our daily life and our nature program at ISP even children who are in fifth grade, children who are in middle school, they still ask about the chickens. And it's something that sparks a lot of curiosity from, from our kids, especially things like, why are there no chicks? Why are there eggs, but there aren't any chicks? You know, why isn't there a rooster there? So it really sparks a lot of joy and wonder. Every day there are people coming to my classroom. Can we go and visit the chickens? Can we take food for them? People bring their own food for the chickens. So we just continue to enjoy them and to find out more about them and to, to involve them in our daily life at school.